I'm quite interested in VFX. When I first started out and I didn't have the budget to do cool effects, I try and work out how to do it myself, basically. So sort of taught myself how to use After Effects. And then like a lot of people during the pandemic started trying to teach myself how to use Blender. I wasn't originally a 3D person. And I guess that's kind of what led me a little bit to, to Polycam. I was doing this other thing, this uh, documentary TV show, where we've got a host who's going around different locations in Taiwan. I kind of wanted a little transitional device to kind of take us from location to location. I just thought, oh, I'll be really cool to use Gaussian spiraling for that. And I didn't really know what I was going to do yet. And it just took a bit of a leap of faith. So I just kind of got the host to stand in the location that I wanted to transition from. And I just walked around him, like shot like a minute and a half video on my iPhone, keeping him in the center, like walking around and around and around, and like gradually kind of spiraling a little bit wider and wider and wider. And then like fed that into Polycam. And the results were actually really impressive. I mean, really, really impressive. I don't think that what I've done is particularly amazing. Yeah, I mean, I don't consider myself a pro in this at all. But, but I mean, it looks pretty cool. And the amount of effort as well, you know, I just had to walk around the guy on set and then Polycam took care of the rest.